dude, you wanted your own space, and you keep getting into my space, and it's really starting to irritate well, I me. I haven't used my space since 2007. Stop so. with the corny comeback. Look at this line. There's a reason there's a line here. All right, here we go. Season two. Are you more hesitant to date someone who has more friends of the opposite sex? The question is more of if you met a girl who had a lot of guy friends that didn't have that type of history, would you be more hesitant to approach her? Exactly. It's like, so you meet a girl, you know, you guys are hanging out a lot, blah, blah, blah. And then you kind of realize, or she tells you, you know, hey, usually that doesn't happen. She usually doesn't tell you. But like, maybe you notice that she's, you know, she has a lot of guy friends, but you actually like this person. You know what I mean? So yeah. would you take that next step into dating if you had the opportunity? Here's the thing, okay? Regardless of what you think, there's always one guy she had a thing with, or she had feelings for, or she did something with in that group, regardless of what you think. There is one guy. No way a girl is gonna be friends with six guys. I would definitely, I would give a chance. You know what I mean? I, and if you walk into the situation too, and you think about like, okay, well, you know, she's friends with Jamil and Javante and, <laughs> and, and, and Jerron and stuff. And you know, they're cool, but like, you know, how cool are they at the same time? It's like, I mean, I've been in situations where like, I had a lot of homegirls and like, an opposite per you know the the person wasn't too happy about it <laughs> like and they make these assumptions where it's like oh well you guys probably have a thing going on or if you know i was in the equation or something exactly so that always pops up the way i'm looking at it is if i was into this guy and i wanted to be with him but i found out he had like eight to nine really close girlfriends I would find that as competition it's kind of like that's really hard to you're talking about at the beginning right like if we're trying to leave this into something else like it, it just seems like it'd be harder for me because you have like all these options like it, that's all i'm gonna look at it as it's like well you have all these girls that are really cool with you maybe some of them like you you don't even know it yet it's just i would i would overthink it so knowing me it's i'm being no, no, honest she's being honest though that the girls can... i'm not I'm, and i don't really feel like i honestly i don't feel like i'm that type of crazy jealous person but it's just a common reaction like you're already so cool with all of these girls and you have other girls that you could be cool with, but you don't know how many of them actually like you or are being upfront about it. It's just like, I don't, like, you know your own gender, you know how they can be, so you just feed off of that. You and also have to trust your guy too. You do, but that's like, I don't know. Like, that's, I feel like trust comes more into when you're actually dating. Say me and you would like a thing, okay? And I had like, like girls, like just hitting on my phone. Oh, yo, when we hanging out? Oh, like what we did last week was awesome. Like, would that make you feel comfortable? I mean, I feel jealous, but I'm not saying that it's correct to feel that. Because it should be okay to have any friends that you want. But, no, but like, would how would that make you feel? I, I would feel jealous, but that, that's probably my fault, though, that I'm feeling that not, jealousy. I should be secure enough in the relationship that I wouldn't feel that jealousy. So that's something that I would need to work on then. What if the situation was explained to you up front? Like, hey, you know, like, I'm interested in you. I really like you. But, you know, like, she has all these dude friends. And, like, hey, these are all my dude friends. They've just been dude friends this entire time. Like, I, but I like you. Like, these are just my boys. Like, they're my, they're my homies. Like, would you still have a problem with that? Because she was straight up and honest with you from the get. I still wouldn't feel comfortable. I think that's weird. If someone's going to tell you more reasons as to why they're more friends with the opposite sex, I wouldn't trust them as much. Because people don't do that. I mean, unless it happens to them a lot. What? Yeah, but I just don't really I feel do, like that's necessary. Like, I don't, I don't tell a guy like, oh, I have so many guy friends. Like, all my close friends yeah, are guys you know, because of about this. It. Regardless of what you, no guy is ever gonna stand in front of you and say I'm okay with a girl with six guy friends. Like, this. dude, that like I said, that's not true. As long as as long as there's open communication, and I know for a fact that all of her six guy friends are strictly her guy friends, I would not have a problem with her having six guy friends. Like some people, you just get along more, with more as friends than you do romantically. It's like a different sort of click. Absolutely. For example, like with me at school, at, 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 you know, at Portland State, I have a lot of friends who are, who are girls because, first of all, like not to be, you know, they're, all, they're always doing better in classes anyways, like the, you know, the people that I meet at school. So like, it's not that I'm trying to get at them or anything. It's just like, I choose to friend them because 
they have you know they have good study habits. They usually have all the notes and everything. Like they're pretty more they're they're a lot more organized than a lot of the guys I know that are taking the same classes. I'm right, taking. right. So you so, use them. <laughs> no, <laughs> but but it's like but it's like it's just you need it's, it's all for things. school. You know, it's not like I'm trying to get at them. Or anything no, you're like just that. you're joining the good the right crowd. Exactly. <clears throat> and so like, but then sometimes I mean, you might find somebody and they might see it as a threat because you want to go study with them because they have all the answers and all the notes and all the you know all all that stuff. And she just she thinks you're just trying to get at her or something or you know like That's, you yeah. see so so for me for being a student I mean I. I I've dealt with stuff like that, so it's... Just because Omar is talking to you in class, ladies, does not mean he's trying to get your number. He's trying to better educate himself. He's independent. He is independent. <laughs> he's a str... <laughs> so I, in my opinion, like, it does push guys away. Like, when a girl has six guy friends or seven guy friends, it does push other guys away because we assume that, you know what I mean, she's just homing around with all of them if they have a group of friends and it's a bunch of friends of the opposite sex just be careful you don't have to be hesitant but like you know just make sure don't, you're don't get walked over don't go into it with the assumption that there's something going on and yeah be more open-minded about it but definitely keep an eye out right exactly but don't stress about it either because yeah. that could ruin the relationship you never know man you don't want to ruin opportunity good-hearted people i like you guys good people <laughs>